frameworks. Part of the fashion that happens in our industry are various frameworks. And we get very excited about a new framework. Ooh, there's a new framework out there. We ought to try that new framework. It's called Bananas. And we have to come up with these weird names for frameworks, right? So, oh, yeah, let's use the Bananas framework. Um, that's fine. It's okay to be excited about frameworks. But you have to understand that frameworks are not made for your benefit, right? They're made for the author's benefit. And there's a, a huge asymmetry when it comes to frameworks. In order to use a framework, you must make a huge commitment to them. You're going to be coupling your code into those frameworks at a really detailed level. The, uh, the, the, the instruction manuals for the frameworks encourage active coupling into the framework. They want you to derive from their base classes. They want you to insinuate their code into your code so that the coupling is tight. That benefits the framework authors. It does not benefit you. The benefit authors do not necessarily have your best interests in mind because they don't really care if you eventually get your application to a point where the framework is in the way. Now, frameworks have this lovely ability to make the first months of a project easy. But then they make the next years of the project difficult. Because you will want to do things that the framework is, didn't ever anticipate and is in the way. It gets in your way and it forces you to work around the framework. So you will, you will discover that as you use frameworks more and more and more. And a good architect looks at every framework with a cost-benefit trade-off in mind. How is it going to help me? How is it going to hurt me? And there's always a, a cost. And a good, a good architect will put a little boundary between the, art, the framework and the rest of the production code. That will hamper your use of the framework slightly, but it allows you to decouple from the framework enough so that the framework can stay safe and unintrusive. Remember this always, in order to use a framework, you must commit to them. They do not commit to you. So it's a deep asymmetry and a problem that an architect has to face all the time.